Up at six now, what a dangerous day out there today. Lightning strikes a worker in Margate, and that was just the beginning. Lightning also struck a home in Coral Springs. Let's get right out to Local 10 News reporter Terrell Fournay. He's live with our top story. Terrell. And the victim of that lightning strike has been identified as Rico Elteen of Fort Lauderdale. He was simply doing some landscaping work here at this apartment complex, which is just off of Atlantic Avenue and uh, North Rock Island Road when that bolt of lightning fell from the sky. It's hard. It's very hard. Susanna Miranda was gazing out of her window as the strong thunderstorms rolled in. When I heard the thunder or whatever it was, um, I'm afraid of them. I kind of went like that, but then I, I thought about him and I went to look at it and he was already on the ground. A 55-year-old landscaper was on the ground after being hit by a bolt of lightning. Susanna called 911, but even arriving paramedics and police officers were met with the same dangerous situation as that electric storm hovered overhead. We've had quite a few lightning strikes and pretty close strikes um, since it's been out there, and that was kind of one of the reasons why they kind of drove back there with the cars to bring him back out here so that that way the rescue personnel could tend to his needs. And even as our cameras recorded on the scene in Margate, the danger was still evident. Could he just have been unconscious? I don't think so. Piercing thunder followed by charges of lightning. In Coral Springs, a home was hit by lightning in the 8100 block of Northwest 5th Street, sparking a small fire. No injuries there. And take a look at this video sent in the local 10 by a viewer. You see a bolt of lightning actually hitting the ground on Alligator Alley in North Broward. Y lo voy a, y lo, le hablo, hey. Parate, parate. Conditions so severe that this landscaper tells us work was being stopped on the grounds so crews could seek shelter just as tragedy struck. And you can see just a drizzle coming down here in the Margate area. The worst of those storms appears to have pushed away from this area. But at the height, I have to tell you that it was some of the most severe uh, thunderstorms I have ever experienced here in South Florida just because of the number of lightning bolts that happened here in the North Broward area. As for that victim who was struck by lightning, we know that he is in critical condition. Again, a 55-year-old man, Rico Elteen, recovering from uh, that hit of lightning. Reporting live from Margate, I'm Terrell Fournay, Local 10 News.